calling me with different names and allegations and everything, forgetting the fact that we fought at the crucial stage and we tried to, you know, get justice for the child. But then I'm thankful to organizers. This is this is a booster. This is encouragement. This is strength. This is what we call strength when your efforts are appreciated and acknowledged. Uh, today, uh, when we're talking about press, and we are here, when the uh, International Press Week is ending, I would want to say uh, a lot of things, rather pour my heart out on different issues. First of all, if I talk about the press, I would request all the journalists throughout the world especially my country, India. Please realize your duty as a journalist. Please quote the correct facts. I've been victim. Today if I'm here, I'm a victim also. I'm a victim of a national channel, which every time comes and, you know, uh, uh, stages a show, or plans a show against me and comes up with false details against me, and I'm damaged. I, I challenge that uh, news channel. I don't want to, since it's a press week, and we are honoring the, <laughs> the press, and talking, highlighting the issues, and the other things. I don't want to name the, uh, name the uh, channel, but then it's really unfortunate. Are we really, are we, are we really civilized? Are we really educated? Uh, are we really understanding our responsibility? See, you know, you're putting someone in danger zone. You're completely damaging someone's reputation without even knowing that what is going to happen to this woman. I mean, that news channel uh, planning shows against me using my personal photographs is completely unfortunate and I strongly condemn it. I feel uh, there should have been someone to question the working of such channels, which are putting women in danger zone. You never know what will happen to us if people, if, if, if someone would start actually trusting those stories, the figure is gone. I am, I am dead. My character assassination is done. My future is damaged. My professional life is damaged, and I, I, I request all of you to stand against such people. It's my request to you, and it's my request to the concerned authorities. Please ban such news channels because 